Gentlemen? Mayor? As you know that the leaves are turning slowly orange as the day goes by, and soon summer will be over. People will put in their barbecues back and resort to eating wholesome food again, and people will start having indoor fun than outdoor fun, and as you count playing in the leaves in America. And you must know that some soon as summer comes to an end, we must get into our routine of making good quality shows. We know that probably half the public will be inside the internet than outside, and we need to make sure all these products of our show are publicly great for adults and kids. Sure, there may be adults that think that our show is too immature, and kids might think that we're just stupid and we don't have anything interesting, but we should prove to the world that we are the only show that dedicates to character development, not like those Team Titans. Correct, Amanda, my good sir? Yes, sir. No problem. Yipperoonie! Well, I hope this autumn will be great. And in my honest opinion, I hope the other episodes are good. Right, boys? You're dismissed. Any uh, new suit changes or something? Well, I um, don't really know. Uh, should I uh, keep my suit on for nostalgia reasons, for the old series and stuff? This is technically series two we're talking about of our lives. Yeah, I guess. But still, I think I like this suit. Rob, you gotta change your suit because, no offense, it kinda looks like you might need a new outfit. Preferably something refreshing because <laughs> I have a nasty, punctuous odor coming from the suit. Hey, that's a little insulting, ain't it? Sorry, pal, it's the truth. You might need to change your update suit. <sighs> What's wrong, Mr. Rob? Oh, hey there. I'm just sitting here thinking to myself while looking after, well, Rob's dog. <coughs> Are you sure that thing is a dog? Well, Signora says so. And you can't argue with Signora. Yeah. So what's wrong, my friend? You do know we live in a day and age where anyone and everyone can turn an innocent cartoon into something great for kids, but it ends up ruining the franchise? What are you talking about, my friend? Do you remember the days before collector's items and stuff? Well, they were still out there, but they weren't as big as what we were. It was a glorious day for all of us, the king of all toys. But now, toys have lame gimmicks. No, they don't have lame gimmicks. It's what a toy is now. We live in a day and age where a gimmick is the only way to get a toy into somebody's heart. What do you mean? Look, before you came around, I was bought by the producer when he was little. And the show I came from was around. Today, people say it wasn't good, but it was remembered for the action. Well, not really. But, in my honest opinion, I am grateful that he bought me. Why? He dumped you, and now you got a bite mark to prove that you've been there for a long time. Yes, I may have been bitten, and I may have lost 20% of my memory. But, in my honest opinion, I am grateful what I have got from this show. I may have not moved in my life, but ever since this page began, I am grateful for what it did. Wow, that's beautiful. I hope that the future of Rob works out. Hey, by the way, where is Signorno? And April? Oh, they're, um, gone out. They're gonna go watch a movie or something. Oh. Well, looks like that was a pretty successful series. <laughs> I can't imagine the villains fell for it. Exactly. Ah, uh, look at that, boys. He's found true love. What do you want, you freak? Oh, can't I say congratulations to the new couple? Uh, you're not really congratulating him. Shut up, you one-eyed butler!
Kids haven't been around since the, a few years ago. You came around the producer's birthday and then you just disappeared. Why you suddenly returned? You must understand, my friends, that we villains have realized something that many TV shows try and do. What's that? Villains today seem to follow a nasty trend of making us look bad. Making us old villains look like idiots. Even I follow that trend in the cartoon world. We always fall for the heroes, but we'll always be dark. That's the whole point. It's to show the world that you can make a difference. Well, you can't make a difference. In the cartoon world, you can. But in real life, it's not possible. Ooh, what do you mean? Think about it. People said that they would make world hunger a reality. Or in this case, not a reality. But now it is the biggest problem ever in history. Crime is still real and other means of stuff that I cannot say. So that's a little bit harsh to say. Shut up, you! But you must understand that you may not be the same as any other hero, but you're in, a, you're in our way to try and solve the problem by making us, or making sure we have no way of getting us to stop evil villains looking bad. So do you understand Mrs. and Mr. Signorno? Are you going to call yourself that? Or not? Nope, but we may be considering this. And what's that? By the sense of your, um, let's just say, unposable arms and lack of tail articulation, I think it's time for you to get an upgrade. Come on, let's go. You'll be fine. 